Hey T, I just wanted to make this quick video to demonstrate to you how this retractor actually works. Uh, this retractor does not have a mechanism that locks based on how fast the webbing extends from the tractor retractor. So no matter how fast you pull it out, it simply will not lock. It's not meant to do that. Normally if it was, it would have a centrifugal clutch on the outside right here and this type of retractor and that car did not have that. So even if you tilt it on its side, and yank on the webbing it won't pull out. The way this locks is this pendulum so in a crash the pendulum would move forward or sideways or backwards and when it does it puts the lock bar into place. The reason it locks when you put it on the side is because you can see that pendulum swings down in any direction and that then locks it at all time. At no time does it lock based on how fast the webbing is pulled out. My guess is the day that it locked in your car and sounded like it broke because probably it got hung on this piece right here and it popped sorry I'm trying to do this one handed and the reason that it used to feel like it locked up when you leaned forward is probably because you were extending the webbing all the way off the spool and that is why it felt like it locked so either the webbing was, the sew pattern was getting hung on this, or, because um, right there is where it's almost fully extended. So this retractor does not lock based on how fast the webbing comes out. It only locks based on if the retractor is tilted in any one direction, or in a crash if it makes that little pendulum swing in one direction. I hope that helps. We'll talk on the phone too.